So, uh, you know, 85th birthday is such a huge milestone. What is it like seeing everybody out here this morning? It's a beautiful sight. It truly is. I mean, every year I'm amazed at how many people show up. And these are, as you saw earlier, other countries as well. And uh, I always think that Elvis would never, ever believe that this is still happening. And this is his 85th birthday when he thought, you know, he was going to be an old timer by this time and no one would be interested. So I think for all of us who knew him, it's always a pleasure to see all these people come and celebrate. And you touched on it there too, but what if, you know, if Elvis were still alive today, seeing this crowd, what do you think would mean to him? He wouldn't believe it. I mean, you know, Elvis uh, always appreciated his fans very, very much. Much, truly, and had a, a it was like a personal relationship with them. Uh, when he would come out at the gate, uh, he would always talk to them, always, you know, ask what music they were listening to, just to keep, kind of keep on top of uh, of everything. So, you know, I, I I think about that a lot about how how much love that there is for him still, not just here but all over the world. I've been traveling and. Uh, Gosh, I, I just, it, it's very emotional for me when I see it. And you touched on it there too, but what are the emotions like for you, you know? Wishing he was here, wishing he could see this, wishing that he was a part of it, wishing, you know, that he was here at home, uh, which, you know, we all know he loved very, very much. So it's still, you know, it's still, it's surreal in, in many ways, and, and it's, uh, it's a good feeling and a bad feeling. It's it's mixed emotions, but mostly it's it's good because um, he's still loved. Is there anything else that you support in touch or you wanted to add this morning? No, I think this is good. We're here for his birthday and a uh, big celebration. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it.